Hey everybody, it's Faith from Firesign Tarot. Hope everyone's well. I have three readings left to do tonight to get these all wrapped up by the end of February. So we're going to hustle through and get them done. Cancer, the universe has decided that you are next. So we're going to tip down and get it rolling. Heavenly Father, Mother Earth, Holy Spirit, Spirit Guides, and Archangels. Thank you so much for being here with me this evening. I ask that you give me clarity of heart and peace of mind to bring Cancer, Sun, Moon, Rising, Venus to their highest possible spiritual good and put them on their highest possible spiritual path. Thank you for blessing me. Please help me pass these blessings on to Cancer, Sun, Moon, Rising, Venus. Loyal heart. Well, it showed itself, so we're just going to let it happen. That one didn't. Okay. Loyal Heart, number 35. Fidelity, Loyalty, Devotion. Evidence of loyalty will appear in your life. Others will prove they are faithful to you, and you will in turn commit fully to them. There is a sure and abiding certainty in your heart. Know that spirit is always loyal to you, no matter the outer circumstances in your life. Trust and have faith, for you are eternally loved, always divinely protected, and divinely directed. Right. Happy, happy, 26. Joy and contentment, a sense of fulfillment, a feeling that all is well. Your desires are effortlessly fulfilled now. Find joy in the present moment, whatever is happening, and be satisfied with things as they are. You're free from the shackles of longing and able to experience the liberation that comes from actually being happy moment to moment. For you have chosen happiness over yearning for it. Now is the time for joy, for the sake of joy, and experiencing contentment. None of this is because of something outside yourself. Your happiness is a result of your being at one with Spirit's plan for your life. All is well. The tide is in for now. Enjoy playfully splashing in it. Queen of Cups. Give me two seconds. Okay. Sorry about that. King of Cups. Ten of Pentacles reversed. Okay. The Fool is at the bottom of the deck.
we have a matched pair. That's always a good sign. I this I'm feeling a sense of turmoil off of this Ten of Pentacles reversed. Just remember, all is well. All is well. All is well, the Empress. Slightly better. There. Talk to me about this Queen of Cups. Mmm. Thought I saw a bit of a storm here. King of Cups. Yeah, turmoil. Empresses here, there could be children involved. There was options, there was temptations, there's turmoil. There's choppy waters, there's healing, there's revelations. Somebody has their guard up, somebody's apologizing. There's a leap of faith here. The releasing of burdens. Ten of Cups reversed, unrest. Why is the Ten of Pentacles reversed here? Two upside downs. Three upside down tens here. Something isn't over. And the world is upside down. Something definitely isn't over. Why is Ten of Pentacles reversed here? Three of Swords. There it is. There it is. Ace of Pentacles. Three of Cups, card of reunion. Two threes. There's a possibility for reunion here. <sighs> Mince the chaos and heartbreak. What's this two of cups? What's this two of cups? Communication. Eight rods. Another Leo card. There could be a Leo somewhere in this mix or someone with Leo in their chart. Let's have Aquarius here. Pisces. Taurus. Strength. The taming of the inner beast. Four of 
four swords, laying things to rest. Five of pentacles at the bottom of the deck. Someone's been out in the cold for a minute. One more. The Hierophant. And the Three of Wands in reverse, no longer having to wait. Why is the world reversed here? Why is the world reversed here? The world in the upright. Two of Cups at the bottom of the deck. I love it when problems fix themselves. I'm not going to dig too deep in, into the turmoil and the chaos. This was turmoil and chaos. She's looking at him with lightning in her eyes. I don't know who did what. It can be vice versa. Put yourself wherever you see fit. But if it's your story, take it. You're a matched pair. And there's overwhelming love and loyalty and devotion. I'm hearing mistakes were made. But there was healing, there was revelation. Coming back together. It's underneath this two of cups. It says nothing. Okay. Make the right choice. Two swords. The Fool, the Judgment, Six of Cups Reversed, Eight of Rods, Seven of Rods, Wheel of Fortune. This was destined to happen. Even set down a new path. A new path of resurrection despite the bad blood. If you talk through it, You battle the inner demons. I think you guys can get through this. Eight Pentacles reversed, Queen of Swords, High Priestess, Five of Cups, Queen of Wands, Hangman reversed, King of Wands, Ace of Rods. If you choose not to get through this, don't put the work in. choose not to be honest or process the emotions that went along with this and get through them you'll stay stuck in separation see how the hangman is between the king and the queen of rods fiery passion but they're separated by this lack of perception building blocks number 28 Strong foundations, beautiful work in progress. You have everything you need to cultivate an extraordinary life. This is a time when your focus needs to be on the foundations you build upon. Your work, your relationships, and your very being are underwritten by your values, ethics, morals, and core beliefs. Are they still true for you? Will they stand the test of time? and serve you as the solid grounding upon which you construct your life. Now you are making changes that will affect everything in a positive way. Your destiny is truly remarkable and beautiful design. Cancer, I love you guys. Thanks for coming down and hanging out. I will catch you next time we go around. Be blessed, y'all.